वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल आई होप आप सब अच्छे हो और आज मैं तो बहुत ही अच्छी हूँ बिकॉज रिसेंटली आई वेंट ग्रोसरी शॉपिंग एंड आई केम अक्रॉस दिस हाई एंड डिपार्टमेंटल स्टोर द बेस्ट पार्ट अबाउट दैम इज ऑल ऑफ दैम आर मेन इन इंडिया एंड इंडिजीनियस कंपनीज एंड आई कैन नॉट वेट टू ट्राई दम आउट तो दिस गेट स्टार्ट सो द फर्स्ट वन वे इज By NTG Chocolate, here it's pecan caramel with thirty-three percent milk chocolate. It weighs eighty grams and um, cost me three fifty rupees. And I love this packaging. This is so freaking cute. Okay, back in the taker. Let's see how this thing is inside. Okay, ये टूटी हुई निकली है. And this is how it looks from behind. चलिए लेते हैं एक बाइट आई टेस्ट सो इट सॉटेड मैं और खा रही हूं इट्स लाइक अ टेन ऑन टेन फॉर मी इट्स कंप्लीटली मेल्ट इन योर माउथ एंड दिस इज अ थम्स अप फ्रॉम मी सो द नेक्स्ट वन वी हैव योर इज बाय पॉल एंड माइक द फ्लेवर इज इटालियन पाइडमेंट हेजल नॉट This one is made in Kerala. I have recently seen this thing that many Kerala brands are coming up with chocolates. Let's open it. Okay, this is different packing. This is how the bar looks like. Okay, I'm just taking like two pieces, and remember to let it melt in your mouth. Do not get hyperactive like me and bite into it. Okay, so this chocolate just completely melted in my mouth, and I don't know. I just didn't find the flavor too great. I just found it to be pretty average, but I'll give it like seven out of ten. Not even seven, a bit less. Because I tried another chocolate of this company, the Belkin Rose, and it was lovely. And there's one thing about this company that they mention stuff like this on the packaging. Where it's mentioned myth number four: the best cocoa beans are from Africa. That the quality of cocoa is determined less by where it grows and more by how it is grown, harvested, and processed. And but do not take our word for granted. But how the fact of how. 18 winners of the 2017 Cocoa Excellence Award. Only were four were from Africa. Okay, so I'm taking their word, but I was not too fond of this flavor of theirs. But no problem, because we have five more chocolates to come. This um, blueberry Belgian white chocolate by a diabetic chef. That's interesting. Okay, I just read this thing on the packet saying. Um, It's zero percent sugar, hundred percent healthy. It cost me two fifty rupees, and it weighs forty grams. Better be worth the price. And here comes our again broken chocolate bar. It smells very exotic, and this is how it looks. This tastes heavenly. One of the first white chocolates that I actually like, and the blueberry taste is stupendous. So I just give it a five thousand on ten. It is a must try. I know it's a bit slightly expensive, but um, what they mentioned about it makes it a total yes. Like being PC was friendly and diabetic friendly. Oh my god, I can't resist having more. The next one is by Cocoa Craft. It's pure artisanal, and it's single origin. So I got all these chocolates yesterday, and it was such an awful task. कि मैं इसको अपने भाई के शिकार से बचाऊं, क्योंकि 
अगर वो इतने चॉकलेट्स देख लेता है ना तो किसी के लिए कुछ नहीं छोड़ता सब कुछ खुद से खा जाता सिबिंग्स होता ही ऐसे फाइनली वन ऑफ द बर्ड्स दैट आर परफेक्टली इंटैक्ट दे जस्ट ट्राई टू पीसेस ओके पर्सनली इट्स लाइक स्लाइटली बेटर देन नॉर्मल कैडबरी यू गेट बट नथिंग टू एक्सॉटिक बहुत दैट टू फिफ्टी रुपीज प्राइस टैग आई थिंक आई जस्ट गिव इट लाइक Or six on it. It's very average, not something that I would really buy up there. So the next one here on the list is by Dido and Frank. It's dark moron chocolate. Wait, it's vegan and luxury dark chocolate. Sorry, it's dark Moroccan chocolate, not moron chocolate. love this packaging it's like i don't know why it reminds me of that willy wonka thingy i was expecting some ticket to go to willy wonka's factory sorry it was just a movie i can literally smell the minty flavor to be then try it out it's i have lost words for it it is par excellence what if you're someone Who wants a perfect amalgamation of dark chocolate and mint? This has to be the one for you. And why not? I think I would give this also a nice ten on ten. But for the experience of this chocolate, why not? Are you not trying this? You should go and buy it. It's not sponsored, okay? No one's sponsoring me videos right now. But soon maybe. Second last one is the whole truth. Okay. So it is seventy one percent cocoa, twenty nine percent dates, and a dash of orange oil. That is, it's hundred percent plain. Bean to bar made in house, no added sugar, and it's orange dark chocolate. Okay, that's interesting. One mint chocolate and one orange dark chocolate. I love this slide on type wrapper of no sun like the seventy percent market acquired with dairy milk. is so cute i think um if your girlfriend loves dark chocolate and orange go for this you could just keep the wrapper or uh, keep the wrapper in paper for yourself and give this it doesn't really look like it's open right i love such i love the effort they put into this so why should all the pieces of the chocolate be the same okay this is what they mentioned This is like very very innovative. All unlike um, the one we saw till now, all these chocolate bars are uneven. The smell of orange just took me to an orange um, field, and now I need this attack. Let's take a bite. I really can't really taste the orange flavor. It's like ten twenty percent orange, and. 100% dark chocolate um the packaging blew away my mind and um the entire idea behind the the bars and the creativity but in terms of orange it really disappointed me it could be a great dark chocolate but orange clear now i think i would just give it a 10 for packaging and for the flavor it would get 8 and a half because orange is not that um great as they mentioned Okay, so my last but not the least chocolate for today is by Sugar Free. It is composite chocolate. It's called Delight, and it's got dark, crispy quinoa and roasted almond. Okay, so recently I came across a survey which was my, which stated that nine out of ten people love chocolate. And the remaining people have bad taste buds. So which one are you? Let's try it. This was an unexpected surprise. I thought since it is more reasonably priced, um, it would not be that great. But it is 
feel issues. I can't stop having it. Looking for something to give like your friends. It's slightly on a lower budget, and this would be the one. I think I would even give this a solid ten on ten. Packaging clay is not that great. Um, you can just gift wrap it, put a beautiful ribbon. That is the end of the video from my end. I hope you guys enjoyed um, my recommendation of the chocolates and my perspective on them. And I hope you get the right chocolate to give your loved ones. I hope you loved this video, and if you did, give it a like. And thank you so much for seeing this video. So till the next time that I get another video. Bye.